They were sightseeing over the Grand Canyon in a helicopter Saturday evening just before sunset when something went horribly wrong. The helicopter crashed and burned in a steep ravine about three miles from Grand Canyon West Airport. At least three people are dead. Four others are seriously injured. High winds and rugged terrain complicated the rescue efforts. Medea Villarreal is near the scene. Moments after the crash, witnesses rushed to help. Ted Fujimoto, a wedding photographer that happened to be shooting nearby, captured video of the helicopter on fire. The accident happened 73 miles east of Las Vegas in a remote area known as Grand Canyon West. It was pretty bad. It's amazing how they survived. These two ladies, you know, are lucky to be alive. The helicopter belongs to Papillon Airways, one of the biggest Grand Canyon tour companies in the area. They've been around for more than 50 years and boast on their website more than 600,000 customers a year. This is the first with Papillon, the first major crash that we know of since the 2001 incident that we were involved with. Attorney Gary Robb specializes in these kinds of accidents. He sued Papillon back in 2001 after another helicopter crash claimed six lives. The helicopter industry is evolving and we're thinking that safety is more and more of an emphasis whereas in the past revenue seemed to really be of paramount importance. We reached out to Papillon Airways but have yet to hear back from them. Rough terrain and severe weather conditions made rescue efforts difficult. It took crews more than eight hours to recover the victims. Four out of the seven on board survived and are being treated at a hospital in Las Vegas. The accident happened here on the Hualapai Reservation in a remote area that we are not being given access to just yet. The local police department is leading the investigation, but we also know NTSB investigators will be on scene helping. In the next 24 to 48 hours, the winds are expected to pick up and be steady. So for now, all choppers in the area have been grounded. DeMarco. Maria Villarreal, thank you.